should I start with the big box or the small one? Big or small? Hi, lock lovers. It's me, Natty Ann, showing you how to enjoy the journey. Now, we're not talking about my hair today, even though it can be an honorable mention because I did get a retwist. Yes. You get some fucking retwist. But no, today is not about hair. Today is actually about Brandon Blackwood. I ordered something. I'm so excited to pretty much unbox it with you. This is my first time opening it, opening it so I'm doing it with you guys. I wanted to treat myself. It's the beginning of summer and I need to do something for me. I wanted to purchase some items from his biannual sale. Um, I think the sale is still going on or there's just some, you know, inventory left. So if you do want to catch the sale, hurry to his website now. But this is what I got. So should I start with the big box or the small one? Big or small? I don't know. Which one do you think I should open first? The big one? All right. Brandon Blackwood, New York. What is this? Okay, packaging. Thank you for your purchase. Enjoy your... What? Enjoy your new... <laughs> Thank you for your new purchase. Enjoy your new piece. And can't wait to see how you style it. XO Brandon. Okay. Cool. You see how that is? It's like personalized kind of. You know, it's a cute touch. If I can put this back in here. That's a cute touch. Quality. You got a nice dust bag. Brandon Blackwood, New York. Okay, you guys are ready? It is so cute. This is so cute. Okay, so the name of this item is the mini Kendrick trunk in citrine. I it's actually better in person. Look at all the rhinestone detailing, the feet. You could take off. It has like rubber covers on it. Silver hardware. I need the scissors. Hold on, let me grab this knife. All right, so this is what it looks like. I got all of the plastic and um, coverings off. Look at that. Can you see that? This is gorgeous. Do you see that shine? All the crystals are lined up perfectly on it. Like I mentioned before, it has the feet. So when you want to put your bag down on the table, it can stand, you know. The rhinestones are all over the bag. The handle is leather. It has his branding on it. Also with the B right here. So, hmm, how do I do this? Oh, okay. See, I'm learning with you guys. So you take the clasp off, it's a letter B, and then you open it. This is small, okay? So I don't even think a phone could fit in there, to be honest with you. So this is really just for your lipstick, your card holder. <laughs> oh, that's it. But there's literally some, hopefully none of your rhinestones fall off, but you know, if it does, they left you with some. And a crossbody strap. Now, I do like crossbodies. But this is so cute and dainty. Like, I don't know if I would even really use it, but it's there just in case. Um, 
fully leather. Yellow. This is cute. Maybe if I wanted like a casual, a more casual look, I can just, you know, sling it across, but it's cute. This was $150 on sale. I think it's usually around $250 if I'm not mistaken. I will have to check the site to see what it is full price, but I'm glad I got it on sale. And it's perfect for the summer. All right, so the reason why I chose this particular bag is because of the color. So when I looked at the website, he had tons and tons and tons of accessories and bags and all kind of stuff on sale. And I was just giving, you know, scrolling, doing a quick search just to see if anything just jumps out at me and catches my eye. Also, I had to keep in mind what I have, what I currently own and what's in my closet now and what I'm lacking in. And I told myself, you know, I don't have any red bags and I don't have any yellow bags. So I'm looking for red and yellow, right? So I'm looking on the site. I did see a red trunk, same style like this, but it was a crocodile embossed kind of style. And the red wasn't as vibrant as I would like. I want that bright, you know, candy apple red. This red was more of, um, you know, the darker, more subdued type of red. And if I was going to buy um, a red purse, I wanted, I want it to be like very bright and popping red. So that trunk was, you know, out of question. I didn't, I didn't choose that one. So I was like, okay, let me see what yellow he has going on. He had this one with the rhinestones. Um, he had another one that was a different um, texture, leather. And the yellow was a little more mustard than this one, which was also nice. But I said, you know what? I want a special bag. If I'm going to buy a bag um, from Brandon, I've been eyeing his collections for a long time now. I just never really bit the bullet on it. So when he said, um, I'm having a sale, buy annual sale, I'm like, this is my chance. So when I saw this, I'm really happy that I picked this to introduce me to the brand. I mean, come on. Look at that. You could dress this up or down. It's small. You could wear it in the daytime. You could wear it at night because it's so small. It's really stunning. It's cute. It's kind of in your face. It's girly. You know, we're in our Barbie core era right now anyway. So we want the girliness. We want the glitz. We want the glam. We want the pink. You know, we want the bright colors. It's summer. So I just thought this was pretty perfect I'm in love and then we have the strap so the strap is the same leather as the handle I really think I could rock with this I could just see myself you know with a nice like tank and some jeans on and just you know bring this out for a little razzle dazzle it is so cute okay on to the next thing I got. My next item is going to be the bamboo card holder in dark brown. Comes in this cute little box. Same packaging. Very good prep packaging. You like that. This is super, super cute. Oh my gosh. You guys, look at this. Are you kidding me right now? Brandon. Brandon. Okay. Brandon, stop. Stop playing with me. No. Okay. I needed a card holder, right? And I was looking on Saks. I was looking at all of the designer leather goods for card holders. And, you know, the YSL ones are really good. 
what Ferragamo has some every every brand has a card holder and when you look on that sex site you start seeing that them card holders cost about you know 200 and up for the leather good i'm so glad that i didn't you know bite the bullet and commit to any of them because once i saw this stop playing first of all look how unique it is this is brass hardware bamboo okay raise your hand if you're one of the girls from the 80s that used to wear the bamboo earrings or the 90s that used to wear the bamboo gold earrings y'all know what i'm talking about shout out to the around the way girls but this is so cute and unique one two three four five six you can fit six cards you can have your ids in here so when you don't want to take a really big bag, you know you're taking a little mini, but you need your IDs, you need your cards. This is it. And the bonus for me is this section right here where you could put some cash. I did not know that it had that middle section right there, and I'm glad to know that it does. So this is the chocolate color. It's brown, gold brass hardware, um, Brandon Blackwood, New York. His logo is on it. I'm happy. I couldn't be happier. They have these in black, which the black is a really good option. But sadly, it wasn't on sale. Um, these run for $120. Um, the black one was not on sale. The brown one was. It was on sale for $60. So I got this for $60. They had an orange one. They had a baby blue one. And I, I believe they had a pink one. So it's not on sale for $60 anymore, but I believe that it's on sale for $86, excluding the black one. So this is good. This is good. And even, okay, say it's nighttime, right? And you, you throw this in your bag, even if you decide to throw it in your big bag and you're searching around the bag for your stuff, you can easily spot it out because of this gold brass hardware on it. And it's hard. It's like has nice weight to it. You can tell that it's not cheap quality. And this is a leather good. So I am, I'm pleased. I'm pleased. I'm not mad at it. I think the, the design is unique. Um, it's very black, you know what I'm saying? The bamboo earrings, it's, it's for the culture. I, I love it, I love it. So that's all I have for my Brandon Blackwood unboxing. I really hope that you guys enjoyed this video. And even though that this wasn't necessarily a lock video, I do know I have some fashion girls um, on my channel, so. I like to call myself a fashion girl as well and i need to start getting into that bag more with you guys so you know if you love this video give it a like subscribe if you're new and tell me what your thoughts are on my pics i will see you guys in the next one bye lock lovers